high-frequency solutions for the world's top communications, defense, and aerospace companies. Corvo is proud to be supplying advanced radar systems for the Joint Strike Fighter, the F-15, F-16, and F-18, and the TPQ-53. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I want you to look to your right, because we're going back to the dawn of the jet age with the, Nor uh, with the Lockheed T-33 jet trainer. It's on the roll. About 5,400 pounds of thrust that is shoving this airplane forward. And at the controls, a gentleman from California who learned to fly when he was in the Army became an air traffic controller down in Oakland, California. And now, flies the T-Bird. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Lockheed Martin 1969. Jackie B coming by, give her away. So the P-80 shooting star, the single seat pursuit or fighter version, he rolls on the upline, lays it over on its back, tilts his head back, looks at Hillsborough Airport and says, I know I'm in the right place. Watch for the smoke to come down. He'll pick up speed now. Even though there are jets today that fly faster than the T-33, this aircraft remains the fastest single engine straight jet About 6,700 or so were built. You see Bill Shepard going by who flew the P-51 Mustang. He's the guy in the khaki flight 90 degrees and knife edge to the upright position. His reputation has gone worldwide as a, we see a 450 mile. How do you like that, Oregon? I said, how do you like that, Oregon? Go ahead and fly my T-33 at Farnborough. So Greg Collier, the man who learned to fly in the Army, became an air traffic controller at Oakland, California's Air Route Traffic Control Center. Recently retired from that, flying air shows, is going international, flying the T-33. It was developed by the Lockheed Skunk Works and the legendary aircraft designer, Kelly Johnson. Among the aircraft that Kelly Johnson and his team designed were the P-38 Lightning. The aircraft which was flown by the number one and two aces in World War II, Lieutenant Richard Bong and Captain Tommy McGuire. He holds it upside down for the inverted pass. The wingspan on this airplane is just about 38 feet, almost 39 feet. Do a slow pass. Let's fade the music out there, John, and let's watch and listen. You can get your cameras on this. You know. a turbojet. Very simple operation really. As a matter of fact, there was a Frenchman back in 1910 who actually developed a jet engine and nobody was interested in it because they were all working on piston engines like the radials, like on Vicky Benzing's plane and the radio and the V12 engine in the P-51 Mustang that we saw. Very simple operation. You suck the air in with a fan. It goes through some more blades that compress that air, that compressed air, so you suck it in, you squeeze it, then that compressed air, and a fuel mixture. 
temperature, and that controls and contro causes a controlled explosion, which sends the gases out the back, making it, giving it forward thrust. So you suck it in, you squeeze it up, you blow it up, and you go. It's a noisy, it's a pretty noisy jet for no afterburner or anything. You will hear the F-16 Fighting Falcon of the United States Air Force's Viper demonstration team and the Blue Angels with their very, very powerful jet engines making a lot of noise and in some cases a lot more noise because they have afterburners. That's an extra stage of the jet engine in which in which raw jet fuel is poured into the exhaust to give the jet a real... The four-point hesitation roll. Such precision. There's the photo pass. The F-80 Shooting Star, the single-seat version of this T-33 that you see here, was actually pitted against Russian-built North Korean fighter jets that had swept wings. They were the MiG-15 fighter aircraft. Successful businesses know that cloud services can cut costs, streamline workflow, and make remote access a breeze. So who is your cloud partner? While you're here at the show, try a Zenner's Sausage, proud sponsor of the Oregon International Air Show. USAA is proud to sponsor this show. USAA has been serving the military and their families since 1922. Stop by their booth for more information. Tuality Healthcare. Healthcare is here. Studies have shown that a close-knit community is good for your health, and at Tuality Healthcare, we care about our community. From delivering your first baby to keeping you active, Tuality provides the best medical care right here in Hillsboro. Tuality Healthcare, the right care right here.